really freaking out over this audition. What if I blow it? Quagmire, when I agreed to come to this, I didn't know it would require this level of emotional support. You Glenn Quagmire? I'm Carson, the producer of the show. Peter Griffin, I should be at work. Okay, let's see what you've got. I think you're gonna like this. Cedar plank salmon with a maple glaze and slow-roasted cherry tomatoes on a bed of mescaline greens. Mmm, not bad. Also, the tomatoes can be eyes and the lettuce can be hair. Look down, there's also a carrot. <laughs> this is great. Terrific food and a hilarious sidekick. This, this is the show. What do you mean? I'm saying you're hired, just as long as your friend joins you. What do you say, Peter? I say let's do it. Whoops. Uh, uh. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. What do I, what, what do I do? I, I don't, I don't know what to do now. That was a wrong choice, Peter. Wow, Quagmire, look at you. You're a real TV chef. I know. It might sound silly, but... Being a chef is something I've always dreamed about. I always dream about my house filling up with water. That's crazy. But anyway, thanks for encouraging me, Peter. All right, places. We're rolling in three, two, one. Welcome back to Quagmire's Kitchen. Now, this mince pie is about ready to go. Just needs a pinch of cinnamon. And while we're at it, how about we take this cinnamon challenge? Okay, Peter, we've all seen the internet videos. We're not doing that. I was talking about something else. I was talking about a serious cooking thing. Now, the ingredients of a mince pie are traceable to the 13th century, when returning European crusaders brought back Middle Eastern recipes containing meats, fruits, and, oh boy, spices. Right here, I'm using cloves. <coughs> of course, most people associate mince pie with Christmas. But I'll be honest, I'm not afraid of a summer mince pie. I remember the first time I had mince pie. Our neighbor, Mrs. Morin, introduced it to me one afternoon. I had house sat for her while she was visiting her aunt in Vernon, and she wanted to thank me. And oh boy, what a treat it was. You done? Yeah. All right, best two out of three, Cinnamon. 